Hey everyone, it's Jonathan Allen here from Camped RV in Stratford, Ontario. Today's video, I've got a brand new arrival to show you through. It's a 2020 Columbus 298 RLC. Uh, this one here is shown in the Compass Edition. It is a triple slide luxury fifth wheel made by Palomino RV. Weighs 11,000 pounds dry weight the way it sits. Uh, and as I mentioned, it's a triple slide rear living room and the front queen bedroom. Also has an outside kitchen. So I'll give you a nice walk around here today and we'll show you the interior as well. Uh, this is the first 2020 to arrive, so it's got all the newest changes, so we'll go over all the different features with you here. Uh, so the front cap, it's got a double coat of clear coat on it. So it's a high gloss clear coat and it's a automotive painted front cap. You can see you got the LED marker lights up in the top corner. LED strip light along the bottom of the cap. And you can see it's got contoured uh, with all your decals in between. Uh, we ordered this one with the six point hydro hydraulic auto leveling system so all the jacks are down right now it's got a button that says auto level and it levels it automatically for you it's got the power awning the awning does have built-in led strip light you got outdoor speakers uh, new this year they've added outdoor led strip lights as opposed to the uh the big round lights that we're used to it's got full basement storage so they got slam latch baggage doors and then magnets that'll hold the door open. So all you do is push it up and the magnets will hold the door for you. And that storage goes right through one side to the other. It's all heated as well, so anything you put in here will stay nice and warm. Outdoor stereo. Uh, so that stereo is separate from indoor, so you can have somebody watching a movie inside and still have your outdoor speakers going with your outdoor stereo. Also has a battery disconnect switch in here as well as ca cable and satellite hookup so if you want to watch TV outside you can. The auto level systems on the other side which I'll show you. And then so those doors they just slam shut. Two 30 pound propane tanks, one on either side. As I mentioned it's a triple slide so it's got the slide out, one slide out on the door side and then two on the other side. And then the six point hydraulic auto level. You can see you got aluminum rims. Uh, all the Columbuses come with a two year warranty. And then all the Columbuses now are coming with a tire pressure monitoring system. So that's all on all Columbuses, they're all included now. They've also switched the door handle this year. They've gone to a Euro style handle. And that awning does have the spring arms in them, so you can angle that awning if it's raining and you want water to trickle off. It does have the outside kitchen. So you got fridge, microwave, as well as a two burner stove in the outside kitchen. So you got some counter space and some cup cabinet space as well. It's a rear living room, so it does have the big rear window. It's got the roof ladder. Uh, also, this one does have the backup camera with it, so it comes with a screen that goes in your vehicle. LED lights on the back as well. <coughs> Pardon me. 50 amp power hookup. I've just used an adapter on it here so, we'll, for the, so we can plug it in. You can see you got another LED strip light on the other side over here. And then the two power slide outs on the off door side. Again, you can see the auto level system. It's six point contact, so two jacks behind the tires, two in front of the tires, and two at the front. And then all the vents are over here. You got your fridge vent on the slide out, furnace vent, water heater, and you got your sewer hookup as well. Storage on the other side, and again, so the auto level system is right on the door. And then this door opens up, and you got your convenience center. So all the hoses and everything can come up through the bottom. You got a water filter system. All your dump valves are uh, inside as opposed to being underslung. Also you got water heater bypass and then uh, cable hookup, uh, access to the water pump, uh, satellite hookup, your winterizing hookup, everything is centrally located right here. So. And you can see it's all a sealed box system, so if water sprays in there, it's just going to drain right out the bottom hole. The 
them right at the front. There's an LED light on the front, as well as switches uh, for the lights on the front cap, and then your light in your storage compartment here. You can see there's the hydraulic system for the jacks, and then there's extra storage area in here, and then spot for two batteries in here. But we'll check out the interior. So the new handle opens right up. You got a screen door that'll separate. So if you just want to use your screen door, you can. But then it reattaches right back to the main door. And as you can see with the new handle, you can open it that way. There's also the deadbolt lock on it. And then it does have the more ride step above steps. So they're on a spring. There's next to no weight to them. You just push them down. They are adjustable with the legs, so if you're on unlevel ground, you can level them out. And then they're an aluminum tread, so much more sturdy than your regular stairs. You can see it's got the nice Columbus name right in the stairs as well. And then with the light in behind there at night, that Columbus name will light up. Alright, so as I mentioned, rear living room triple slide, so right at the back it does have the nice big sofa that'll pull out to a bed. So that'll actually pull out to almost uh, probably bigger than a full size queen bed. You got cabinets up above for storage. You can see lots of windows, the hard valances around the windows, day night shades on all the windows. You got reclining theater seating over here, and they're actually power, so you just hit a button. And they open and close. Also you can see you got USB ports built into your cup holders and then they light up as well. The AC is ducted through the ceiling and it's a quiet cool system so you don't actually see the AC unit. And then we ordered this one with the kitchen fantastic fan and then that does come with a remote control. And then, so there is a holder for the remote control. The remote control is sitting under the bed right now, but that's where you can store it. And then you can hit a button to open and close it, turn it on and off. The entertainment center is right across from the theater seating. You can see nice big wall-mounted TV. Cabinet storage down below, and then it's got a built-in sound bar. We do have a DVD player down below. And then you do have the electric fireplace down below that. Hidden storage in behind the TV. So this is above the outside kitchen. So they give you lots of extra storage in behind there. You see nice big island. And then it does have the two stools with it that you can move around. Table and chairs in the slider right beside the entertainment center. You can see a nice big window beside the dinette. There is an extension on that table that slides out. And then nice residential style chairs. And then there is storage inside those chairs. All the interior lights are LED. And they're nice and bright and they use very little energy. We ordered this one with the 18 cubic foot gas electric fridge. So it is propane and electric, so even if you're not plugged in, you can run it off propane. You can see lots of drawers and cabinets for storage. Tons of pantry storage as well. You can see 110 plugs. You got your thermostat for the furnace and the air conditioner. Does have the three burner stove with the glass cover that folds up, acts as a backsplash. Does have the oven down below. You see, you got a storage drawer down below, and then it's got the microwave up above. Even another little cabinet up above the microwave as well. The fridge has lots of room, as I mentioned. 18 cubic foot, four door, fridge at the bottom, freezer at the top. It's got the nice tile look, linoleum flooring. 
So that's all one piece flooring all the way through. AC, as I mentioned, is ducted through the ceiling. And the heat, you can see the heat registers in the floor down on the main level. And then through the stairs as well. It does have the tablet system, which you can actually control your auto level jacks right from inside as well. Put them up and down. See, there's an auto level button as well. They've got USB ports randomly placed around, so it's easy to charge up all your devices. You can see nice wood treads on the stairs. Nice handle to grab onto when you're going up and down the stairs. Coat closet right when you walk in. Bathroom's fully enclosed. So you got a porcelain foot flush toilet. Nice big shower. It's a two-piece ABS shower and you got the glass sliding door. There is it's a frosted sliding door and then you get a seat inside the shower. And then there is the skylight up above the shower as well. That's in natural light, but also gives you some extra headroom. Roof vent with a built-in fan. Storage cabinet beside the toilet here. And then you got the vanity. There's storage down below the vanity and then double medicine cabinet up above. And then the bedroom, which is completely private up at the front. Full-size queen bed. Upgraded uh, memory foam mattress. See, so you got the reading lights on each side of the bed. Full wardrobe at the front. So it is prepped for washer dryer in the front closet. And then the sliding doors. So they just have latches that you undo. Slide right open. You can see it's a walk-in closet. You got shelving for storage and then all the room for all of your hangers. And then again it has the bedroom fantastic fan. Comes with a remote again. So there's a holder for the remote. See nice big window in the bedroom. You got the dresser across from the bed and it is pre-wired for a TV up above. Mount the TV on the wall there. And then it does have the sliding door with the built-in mirror on it. And then you do get storage underneath the bed as well. You can see all the welded aluminum framing, the gas, the gas struts that'll hold that door or the bed up for you as well. And carpet in the bedroom, and no carpet anywhere else, which is definitely a plus. The only other place you do have the carpet is right inside the slide out. Also has a living room ceiling fan. But as you can see, it's nicely equipped. So again, this is the 2020 Columbus 298 RLC. So that's in the Compass Edition. It, again, it does weigh about 11,000 pounds dry weight. Uh, but we now have this model in stock at Camp at RV in Stratford. You can check out all of our available inventory on our website, which is campoutrv.com. We do have quite a few Columbus units in stock. We always have them on order. Love to see you in the store. Come on in, check out this great fifth wheel. Follow us on social media. We have a great Facebook page, Instagram, great YouTube channel. But best yet, we'd love to have you in. So thank you again for watching our video.